Hi everybody, Jiggy Time Gal, and welcome back to a new video. Today, we're going to be taking this little basket here, this little square basket, and we stuck some floral foam in it, just enough to get some flowers in it. We're going to put some leaves, we're going to put this cute little zigzag pattern pumpkin, um, some florals, and decorate it up for fall. So, um, without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. Um, I have some of these um, leaves. So, we're going to cut off some leaves. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and stick some things in, around the edges. Okay. And we're going to stick in a centerpiece flower. I think we're going to use this bright red mum. Then we're going to put some um, sunflowers. Next to it. Both sides of it. Okay. Going to stick our pumpkin down here in the middle, in the front. We're going to have to that in.
Check it's back. Let me put some of them back. There we go. Fluff up the flowers a little bit. There we go. Looks pretty. Back's held on up. No holes in it. Wait, there might be a hole. There's a hole right there. I need to take care of that. So we'll put Oh. Pull up the hole. No holes. Looks pretty. Very festive. Very pretty. Get the glue strings out. Fluff the leaves. Uniform. What's done on one side is done on the other to make it look balanced. And it's very pretty. So there you go. There was the tutorial for today, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed yourselves. I enjoyed spending time with you. It was a quick little tutorial for today. Just this cute little basket. And that was it. Just a quick one today. Thank you very much for joining me. Have a nice day. Take care of yourselves. And we'll catch you on the flip side. And hey, while you're at it, why don't you subscribe to the channel? Leave a link or leave a comment down below and let me know how you're doing. Let me know if I'm doing all right. And let me know what you're up to lately. Click the like button. Clicking the like button really helps my channel grow and supports me. Share the video on other social outlets, social media outlets. And click the notification bell and click all so you know when I have a new video that's uploaded or when I go live. That really helps my channel as well. So um, supporting me is a really big deal for me. Um, I'm not a very big channel at this time, and it helps me to grow and reach more people on YouTube and allows me to grow my audience. So if you would like to support me, that's the best way you can by clicking the like button, subscribing, clicking the notification bells, and sharing my content on other social media outlets. That's the best way you can support me at this time. So I would really appreciate it if you take the time to do that. And thank you very much. And with all that being said, y'all have a wonderful night and we'll catch you on the flip side.